Hello? Is anyone here? Hello? Whatever you're selling, we do not wish to buy. I'm not selling anything. I've come to join the Musketeers. The Musketeers? You are a woman. You speak as though it is wrong for a woman to wish to serve God. What is your name, woman? Annabelle, daughter of Athos, former captain of the Musketeers. And who might I be speaking to? I am Evel, captain of the Castle Guard. I've heard tale of your father, Annabelle. You of all people should know that in order to be a musketeer, you must be willing to die for the king. I am willing to die for the king, but that won't be necessary because God will keep me safe from harm. Should you not be looking after your father and mother? My parents have recently passed away in their old age, and I have honored them faithfully all of my life in obedience to God and his word. Now I want to serve the king as a musketeer like my father. And did your father teach you to be a musketeer? No, he did not think it proper for a girl to become a musketeer either. Then who will teach you the ways of a musketeer? God will. He has brought me this far, and he will finish what he has begun. Well, my dear Annabelle, I regret to inform you that there are no more musketeers. How can that be? There are hundreds, even thousands of musketeers. I've heard my father say so himself. What your father did not know is that they have all recently returned to their homes. Then I will be the only musketeer. That's very noble of you, but I'm afraid you missed my point. The musketeers were disbanded earlier today. Anyone wearing the cloak of a musketeer shall be put to death. Says who? By order of the king. Now, go back to where you came from, Annabelle. The king? That is not possible. Psst, Annabelle. Who's there? D'Artagnan, a musketeer. But the captain said... I know, and it's true. The musketeers were disbanded this morning, and most of them have gone. But there are a few of us that smell a rat. We could use your help. What do you want me to do? Come, I'll explain later. Let's join the others. Cardinal de Moon, I just heard that the musketeers were disbanded this morning. Why was I not informed? I did not think it was necessary to burden you with such trivial matters. I do not think the musketeers are trivial. But, Your Majesty, our country is no longer at war like it was when the musketeers were formed. We have the castle guard to protect you, and I thought you would be better served if all those musketeers returned to their homes and did some real work so they could pay taxes like everyone else. I need not remind the king that we must keep the treasury full of gold. A rich king is a happy king. I suppose the treasury is a little low. I just wish you would discuss the matter with me first, that is all. You're so right. I did overstep my boundary. I do apologize. I suppose you did the right thing. I am new at this. Yes, and it is a great responsibility to be king. I was your father's trusted aide. I'm just trying to help, your majesty. Thank you. I'm... I'm sorry to have bothered you. It was no bother. <laughs> Now that those musketeers are out of the way, no one can stop me from becoming king. What was that all about? Our precious king was upset about the disbanding of the musketeers. Do you blame him? Most certainly not. <laughs> <laughs> what brings you here? We had a visitor, a woman wanting to join the musketeers. A woman? Not just any woman. She's the daughter of Athos. How is Athos? Dead, of course. And she doesn't suspect a thing. She says he died in his old age. Well, he was old. And he did die. You made sure of that. A little poison does our body good. <laughs> 
So the former captain of the Musketeers has a daughter who wants to follow in her father's footsteps. When I told her there were no more Musketeers, she offered to be the only one. What? She was obviously eager to learn the ways of the Musketeers. I explained to her the consequences of her or anyone else donning the cloak of a musketeer and sent her on her way. You fool, don't you get it? It is no coincidence that this woman has shown up the very day the musketeers are disbanded. God has guided her here. Huh. What do you want me to do? Find her and bring her to me. Yes, your eminence. Perhaps I can get her to join me in my quest to be king. If not, she'll have to die like a father. <laughs> uh, got any threes? Go fish. Oh, you're cheating, Parthos. How many times have I told you? No cheating! Are you calling me a cheat? I saw your cards! Why do you think I asked for a three in the first place? Aramis, you saw my cards? Isn't that considered cheating? You're changing the subject. I asked for threes, and you said you didn't have any. That's cheating. But if you hadn't cheated by looking at my cards, I wouldn't have had to cheat by telling you I didn't have any threes. Good point. The only point to be made, gentlemen, is that neither of you should be cheating. You are, after all, musketeers. D'Artagnan, my dear fellow, haven't you heard? The musketeers have been disbanded. So now we have taken up the fine art of playing Go Fish. It's not as messy as real fishing. That's all very nice. I have a surprise for you two. May I present... Annabelle. Oh. A pleasure to meet you. My name is Aramis. I believe two people should greet each other with a holy kiss. I don't think so. Aramis, if you want to kiss a lady, you can't waste words like that. You just grab her and... That's not a good idea. Stop! That's not how we musketeers treat women, and especially not the daughter of Athos. Annabel, please accept my humblest apologies. And mine as well. If you ever touch me again, you will pay for it. Get the point. A sense of humor. <laughs> I like that. Yes, but a little too quick to pull her sword. She needs to learn a little respect. And who's going to teach me? You? What my friends are trying to say, Annabelle, is a person never pulls his sword on a musketeer unless he or she is ready to die. Put down your sword, Annabelle. Don't ever do that again, or you'll pay for it. Get my point? <gasps> She's good. She's the daughter of Athos. She has to be good, but not good enough. <laughs> she wants to be a musketeer. Does your father know? He's dead. I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. How did he die? You, you don't mind me asking. Old age. I went to check on my parents one morning and they were both dead. Died in their sleep, I guess. Two people dying in their sleep at the same time? Sounds fishy. There was no sign of a struggle. I buried them and came here to join the musketeers. We could use the help. And who's going to train her? All of us. That's why I brought her here. Is she going to pull her sword every time she's corrected? She's not, uh, <clears throat> stupid, is she? Stupid people hate correction. God wants his children to receive correction when they are wrong. I will submit to your authority as unto the Lord. We'll train you. But we can't officially make you a musketeer. Only the king can do that. And since we're temporarily disbanded, this could be dangerous for you. I know, but I wish to serve God more than man. I know God is on my side. Then let the training begin. One for all and all for one. Don't tell me you're praying. I was simply measuring the length of my hands to make sure they matched in length. That way when one hand commits a sin, the other hand can easily cover it up. Hmm. Not very trustworthy. 
No, on the contrary, I always do what I say I'll do, even if it is wicked. <laughs> <laughs> you said you have news for me. I trust you have Annabelle? We don't have her yet, but we know where she is. Shante found her in hiding with three musketeers. I thought the musketeers were disbanded. Yes, sir, they were. I disbanded them myself. Not if there are three musketeers left. You are not very trustworthy, Captain Evil. You didn't do what you were supposed to do. But, sir, I have no control. <clears throat> My dear Shante, is it? Why didn't you bring Annabelle to me? I did not know I was supposed to bring her. I thought I was just supposed to find her. Must I tell you God's every little detail? If I want her found, isn't it logical to think that I want an audience with her? An audience with her? That I wanted you to bring her to me. Oh. I was just doing my job, I thought, your eminence. Did it ever occur to you to do a better job than what you were told to do? No, sir, but if I had tried to bring her, I would have had to kill three musketeers. Now that would have been a job well done. Three dead musketeers is great news. Instead, the captain had to interrupt my dinner with disappointing news. Bad form, Shante, and bad form, Captain. Don't let it happen again. I want Annabelle. I don't care if you have to kill a hundred musketeers. Yes, your eminence. You know, a musketeer does above and beyond what is expected of them. Your castle guards are somewhat lacking in that area. Shantae would make a lousy musketeer. Kill her. No, please. I know where she is. I'll bring her to you. Finally, some good news. Do not disappoint me again. Now I'm ready for dessert. Oh, would you have killed me? I do what I'm told. Nothing personal. Gather some more men and let's get that girl. What time did you tell them to be here? Tell who what time to be here? Annabelle and D'Artagnan. I told them to be here at nine o'clock. Well, it's after nine. They're late. Um, maybe she forgot. Well, forgetting is really disobeying. My mother always told me that when I didn't do what I was supposed to do. Smart mom. Yes. Everything she did, she did as unto the Lord. She was a God pleaser. She would have been a good musketeer. She taught me to always do the right thing. They're late! Oh no, you're starting to repeat yourself. So? You always repeat yourself right before you get angry. Just settle down and do the right thing. Well, 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 what have we here? A meeting of the Musketeers. A training session, actually. We're just about to start. And who are we training today? Well, that's easy. You would still need to be trained since you dropped out of musketeer school yourself. Correct me if I'm wrong, but a person chooses to drop out of something. The captain here was kicked out by someone else's choice. Athos had no reason to kick me out of the training. Ooh, still upset about that. Upset enough to kill Athos and his wife while they were sleeping? I don't know what you're talking about. Liar. God wants his children to be trustworthy, willing to accept responsibility for their actions. I think that's the reason Athos kicked him out of the musketeer's training in the first place. Musketeers always tell the truth. He does not. He lies. The only good musketeer is a dead musketeer. That's what I always say. Huh, would you look at that? It's time to start training. Sorry I'm late. It, you started without me? Now what did you do that for? Three against one. Now that's not very fair. 
It was ten against two on the other side of that hill. Now how fair is that? I suppose I have what I came for. I'll be going now. Ha! <laughs> ten against two? That's why we're late. They ambushed us on our way over here. They got Annabelle. Why am I always getting interrupted at mealtime? Lately, I seem to lose my appetite after our little meetings, Captain. This time, you will be pleased, Your Eminence. Shante! Your Eminence, may I present Annabelle, daughter of Athos. Annabelle, what a pleasant surprise! Captain, is this any way to treat our guest? Untie her. Yes, your eminence. Well, go on. Annabelle, you may kiss my hand. Why would I want to kiss your hand? Well, in reverence of me, the cardinal, it is a sign of worship. God wants his children to live reverently before him. I respect your position as cardinal but I will not worship you. It is proper to kiss my hand when you enter my presence for the first time. I will kiss no one until God has shown me the man I am to marry someday. My lips are saved for him alone. Feisty, isn't she, Captain? Yes, your eminence. Shante, how many musketeers did you kill to get her? None, your eminence. We fought with one musketeer and we were lucky enough to get away with her. Lucky, eh? We as in you and the captain? No, your eminence. It was myself and nine other guards. Ten against one? And he still lives? Where was the captain? The captain and the other guard, Rufus, were over the hill fighting the other two musketeers, you know, to keep them from interfering with the capture of Annabelle. And did the captain and Rufus kill any musketeers? No, your eminence. The musketeers managed to kill Rufus before the captain got away. Lucky for the captain. Let me see if I have this right. We had a grand total of 12 castle guards against three musketeers, and we lost one of our men. Actually, we lost a total of eight. The musketeer my squad was fighting killed seven of us. It was myself and two others that got away with the girl. You've never killed a musketeer, have you, Shante? No, your eminence. Then let me be the one to teach you. Hand me your sword. It's really very simple. You hold the sword by the handle here, like this. And then you take the pointed end and stick it in the musketeer. Like this. Ugh. Sounds to me as though you need to find some more guards, Captain. Find some that know how to fight with a sword this time. Get rid of this body. Yes, your eminence. Annabelle. What do you want with me? Yes, let's get right to the point, shall we, Annabelle? I would like to arrange a meeting between you and the king. Interested? Of course. A musketeer has the greatest respect for the king. He's God's chosen leader of the people. God's chosen leader, yes. Do you mind not mentioning the M word? I'm not real happy with him right now. Why would you arrange for me to meet the king? Well, I'm sure he would be delighted to meet the daughter of Athos, former captain of the M word. And I'd like you to give him this sword in the gut. You want me to kill the king? I would rather die myself. That can be arranged. If my father were here, he would. I know very well what your father would do, which is why he is dead. What? What are you saying? Tell her, Captain Neville. Tell her a wonderfully evil plot. But... I... Tell her. In order to assassinate the king, we knew we had to disband the musketeers. By disbanding the musketeers, we knew it would alert your father and we were concerned that he would arouse suspicion in the other musketeers. Please, we are no longer using the M-word unless it is in a sentence where they have been killed. Thank you. You mean the musketeers? Yes! That's 
the M word. Then I will not say musketeer. Ah! Sorry, a slip of the tongue. This is strange. All of a sudden, I am craving a candy bar. Uh, three musketeers. Ah! Must, ah! must you always spit on me when you do that? Oh, I beg your pardon. So, Annabelle, in the night, we place poison in the glass of water next to your father's bed. Your mother must have drunk from it as well. <gasps> it was painless, I assure you. And now that the M-words are out of the way, with the exception of your three friends, we will kill the king, and then I will step up and rule this great land. You'll never get away with it. That's where you are wrong. Now either join me as my queen, or die. My body is the temple of the Holy Spirit. I would prefer not to look at you or listen to anything you have to say ever again. So be it. Gods! Should I kill her, your eminence? Yes! Wait! I have a better idea. Lock her up. We'll use her as bait and set a trap for those M-words. They will come looking for her, and when they do... But, your eminence, I took the liberty of sending some guards to take care of the, uh, M-words. If all goes well, they will never make it here. Ah, if all goes well. Nothing thus far has gone well. So until all does go well, we will follow my plan. What about the king? Who's going to assassinate him now that she won't? I've already made other arrangements. I knew she would say no from the start. And now, if you'll excuse me, my dinner is getting cold. Lock her up in the tower. I could have made such a lovely couple. I think you're better suited with a donkey. Didn't your father teach you to behave honorably? I am a cardinal and will be referred to as your eminence. You know nothing about honor. You are supposed to be the king's personal spiritual guide, but you plot to murder him. You do have a point. My father taught me to value people's respect, but above all value God's respect. You are cardinal now but I will see to it that you aren't for long. Your eminence. Your father would have been very proud of you, if he were alive, that is. It is a pity things didn't work out differently. You might have made a fine musketeer. I said the M-word. Oh well, I'm afraid the king isn't dubbing any new M-words at this time, or at any other time. Before you can wear the cloak, one must be a musketeer at heart. I already am a musketeer, on the inside. You are a woman. You are no musketeer. Drats, I said it again. You are a bad influence on me. A musketeer desires to learn, receives correction, is trustworthy. Reverent, reverent honorable, loyal, and peace-loving. Yes, I know the creed, but that does not make me a M-word any more than it does you. That's because you only know the creed. I live it. Not for long. I won't be needing you anymore once the musketeers are dead. Oh, musketeers are dead. That has a nice ring to it, don't you think? God, if she tries anything, kill her. Did you hear that? It came from over there. So, how do you like the view here in your castle tower? It's lovely, but the food stinks. Let's go home. Wait, we have to stop Cardinal Damone. He's going to try to kill the king. If you weren't so evil, Lady Dufall, I would marry you myself. Do you have the money? It's all here. 
I've arranged for the king to come by my chambers, at which time he will be smitten by your beauty. Literally. Tell me, how do you plan to do it? I don't like to reveal my methods of murder. Let's just say, when I let down my hair, I have to put this hairpin somewhere. What about the guards? Captain Eville, the one in black with the patch on his eye, will arrest you and escort you safely out of the village. Before you go, you will have to hit him in the head to make it look like you escaped. After that, you will never hear from me again. Sounds like you've thought of everything. Oh, I have, I can assure you. I have thought of everything. Now, if you'll excuse me. What about the musketeers? We don't use the M-word around here. But trust me, I have thought of everything. So how does he plan to kill the king? I don't know. He tried to get me to do it, to stab him with a sword. What did you tell him? I'm going to pretend you didn't just ask that question. We could just walk away from here and live our own lives in peace. Or we could keep our promise to protect the king. We're musketeers. As children of God, we should behave honorably. Let's keep our promise. How are we going to stop a plot to kill the king when we don't even know what the Cardinal's plan is? We may already be too late. Let's not forget God is on our side. Our enemy is the devil, but God is on our side. Three musketeers. I count four. So do I. I stand corrected. Four musketeers. One for all. And, and all, all for, for one. one. Bravo. Very touching. <laughs> but I'm afraid you are all under arrest. And soon you will be executed. What is it this time, Captain? Good news and bad news. And the bad news is? Annabelle escaped. Four guards are dead. What? Give me one good reason why I should let you live. That brings me to the good news. We have all of the musketeers and Annabelle locked up, waiting to be executed. Surely you jest with the guards you employ. I have new guards, remember? The musketeers killed all of the weak ones. Care for a three musketeers bar? Are you serious? Yes, of course. Thank you, thank you. You have made me so very happy. It's just a candy bar. Not the candy bar, you moron. The capturing of the musketeers. That is good news. Oh, this is all working out so nicely. In a couple of hours, the king will be dead, and we'll blame the musketeers. No one will ever believe the musketeers killed the king. You're right. They are loyal to their death. But then, evil company corrupts good habits. What are you thinking? Perhaps there's a way to link the Lady Dufall with the musketeers. Her beauty does have a way of persuading even the strongest of men. Yes, choosing the wrong friends can be deadly. Ooh, well said, Captain, well said. Have your new guards take the musketeers to the edge of the village along with Annabelle. Designate a meeting place, and when you arrive with the lady to fall, kill them all. Oh, that rhymes. Did you say kill the Lady Dufall? Yes. How else can we link them together unless they are all found dead together? Make it look like they killed each other. But your agreement with the Lady Dufall... I... My agreement with her means nothing if it gets in the way of my becoming king. Loyal I am not. Yes, your eminence. 
At the stroke of nine, I will find the king and bring him to my chambers. Have the Lady Dufour waiting there. And Captain, try not to mess this up. Yes, your eminence. Guard! Yes, Captain. Take a squadron of men and escort the musketeers to the south side of the village. Hide out in the old mine shaft until I arrive with the Lady Dufour. It may be a few hours. Yes, Captain. And may I say, it's an honor to work with you. You have always been a hero of mine. Really? I've never thought of myself as anyone's hero. Well, you're my hero. I won't let you down. You, get the horses. I'll get the musketeers. Lady Dufal, the king will meet you here shortly. Your Highness, I uh, did not expect to find you here. What a pleasant surprise. Strange, the Cardinal said he would bring the king at nine. Perhaps the king was eager to meet me. Perhaps. I see your point. Oh, my hairpin. That's better. Uh, your Highness, may I present the Lady Duval? How cute! He's shy. Yes. Why don't I leave you two alone? I will be right outside the door. Just holler when you're finished. Oh, by the way, the Cardinal mentioned your concern about the Musketeers. They have been disposed. I suppose there's no stopping the Cardinal now. If you only knew. No need to be shy. Just relax, your highness. You're not the king. The name is D'Artagnan, a musketeer. Captain! Done so soon, Lady Du... Uh, your highness, is anything wrong? It's, has anyone stabbed you? <sighs> D'Artagnan! You are not the king? How did you... Let's just say your guards would make lousy musketeers. So I've been told. Oh, the Cardinal is going to kill me. Unhand me. I did nothing wrong. You tried to kill the King. Where are you taking me? To prison. Perhaps I can persuade you to let me go, Musketeer. No one would have to know the truth. God wants his children to be loyal, faithful to him and his word. As a Musketeer, I am loyal to God, to my King and my country. You, Lady Dufall, are not on the list. Captain, I see you've discovered the musketeers have escaped. It's a pity they've already killed you. Ugh. You're not dead. Finally, something good has happened. Now I can kill you myself. You failed me for the last time, Captain. Where is Annabelle? I don't know. She should be here. Isn't the king going to dub her an official musketeer? We are gathered today to honor Annabelle, daughter of Athos, former captain of the Musketeers. There she is. Before we begin the ceremony today, I would like to open with a prayer. Cardinal Damone? What? what? Please, please, put away your swords. It's all a misunderstanding. Before he prays, Cardinal Damone has asked to say a few words on his own behalf. First, I would like to begin by saying what a fine job you musketeers have done in saving our beloved king. I know some of you may think I was behind the plot to kill the king, but I can assure you whatever you have heard about me are lies. All lies. Your Highness, this is a trick. The plot to kill you was all his idea. He tried to get me to kill you. I was merely being used by the evil Captain Evil, a puppet in his hands. 
forced to do as he commanded or be killed myself. With the musketeers having been disbanded, I had no one to turn to for help. When I saw that the musketeers had escaped, confident that they would stop Captain Neville, I warned the king of Captain Neville's plot to kill him. It's true. He warned me right before D'Artagnan found me. That's how I knew to have D'Artagnan disguise himself as me and wait in the cardinal's chambers. And if we hadn't escaped, would you have let them kill the king to save your own life? I did the right thing at the right time. My desire has always been for the king's well-being. I smell another rat. So do I. I am asking you musketeers to put aside your feelings and be willing to forgive. Search your hearts for a way to make peace with me. After all, God wants his children to be peacemakers. I sincerely apologize for anything I said or did in these past few days. I was not myself. Now that Camp de Neville is dead and his plot with Lady Dufal uncovered... It was you that hired Lady Dufal. Can you prove that, Annabelle? Well, no. But I heard him say that he had someone else. I know, I know. It was all part of the game I was forced to play, Annabelle. I'll prove it to you. D'Artagnan, who was it that came to assist Lady Dufal while you were disguised as the king? Captain Evil. There. You see? Captain Evil. Musketeers, I understand and appreciate your concern, but I trust Cardinal Damone with my life. Now let's continue what we came here to do. Let us close our eyes and pray. Heavenly Father, I thank you for this day. We thank you for our king. Thank you for the musketeers. Thank you for the food we eat. Thank you for the birds that sing. Thank you for three musketeer candy bars. Thank you for a second chance <gasps> at killing the king. What? Stop, musketeers. Put down your swords or I'll kill your king. Oh, this is working out so nicely. First, I will kill the king. My guards will kill the musketeers and then we will all live happily ever after. I always say, overcome good with evil. You won't be needing this crown any longer, your highness. Now, king, prepare to... <gasps> Annabelle, how did you... The cardinal is dead! <gasps> Please! We don't want to fight you. We're just following orders. You saved my life, Annabelle. You were right, Musketeers. It appears as though Cardinal Damone deceived me, but I am proud of you for not demanding to have your own way in this matter. That is why you, along with Annabelle, are the best of the best. As you pursue peace, truth, and justice, I dub thee, Annabelle, the Musketeer. One for all, and, and all, all for one. one. Please share Fish Bites for Kids on social media, and we'd really appreciate you taking a moment to rate and review this podcast to help reach more people. Thanks for listening, and come back soon for more Fish Bites.